Hello everybody and thanks for checking out my review. Today I'm going to continue on with the Tag Heuer Connected series or the Wear OS series and I'm going to talk about how to download watch faces to your smartwatch. Uh, so the first thing I'm going to do is I want to work with the watchmaker application. So you're going to want to go to the Google Play Store on your Android or you're going to go into the App Store on your iPhone and you're going to download the application. It's called the Watchmaker. And when you download it, you're going to open it up and the first thing you're going to see is a bunch of different bundles that they'll sell you. Um, one thing that you're going to want to do is take at least a one week subscription uh, into this. So this way you could download watches into it. Um, you can continue the subscription if you plan on doing a lot more over time or you can cancel it. And then at that point, you're going to have the watch faces on your watch. So what you're going to want to do to be able to set this up is you're going to want to go into the settings. And when you go into the settings, you're going to see watch and it's going to be select watch. And in this case, you're going to want to select other watch. The nice thing is this does also work with the Apple watch. So when you select the other watch, you go back into the main screen here and I've already downloaded some watch faces on here. So I go into my watch face screen and I'm going to walk you into how to go from a website and you're going to want to go into particularly for the tag Hoyer, a website called caliber 11. So to get into the watch faces, you're going to want to go into the top right of the screen here here with the three lines and you're going to want to go into the forums and once you're in the forums you go into the tag Hoyer connected and you go into the watch faces and I already went to a specific watch face that I want to download here so when you go through the threads on this website you're going to see a ton of different watch faces that you're able to download and the way you're going to do this is you're going to want to copy the link that it gives you on that website and you're going to go back into the application and on the top right you're going to see the three dots so you click on that you go into import watch and then you're going to import from URL and what you're going to do is paste that website page into that little section and you press OK and you can see right off the bat it downloaded right to the smartphone. So what you're going to want to do to transfer this over is, first of all, you're going to want to keep your watch plugged in because it's going to connect to Wi-Fi and it's going to just be an easier and quicker connection. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to push in the screen to get into the settings here, and you're going to press the little gear on the bottom. And then you're going to see a little cloud on the top. So you're going to click on the cloud. And you're going to get a little code here. So you're going to, on the smartphone you're going to hit the little green button there and you're going to see the same code and what you're going to do is press send on the smartphone and on the watch you're going to press ok and then you're going to see a little loaded screen and then the watch face is going to load up and that's pretty much the easiest way to do it and you're able to on different watch faces they're going to have different complications within those watch faces so you can press the bottom of the screen here and this is going to be for steps you're going to press the top and that's going to give you the weather. So that's per, that's for that particular watch face right there. But you're going to be able to just download a ton of them. I hope that you're going to find this helpful. I know it's not a very long video, but I just wanted to kind of give you a, a hint or tip on how people are able to download these watch faces to their smartwatch. All right, so that's how easy it is to download aftermarket watch faces to your Tag Heuer connected or Wear OS device. So if you like this video, please press the thumbs up. If you really like it, press subscribe and hit the bell for notifications on future reviews that I'm going to be doing. And by all means, if you have any better applications or better websites to be able to get better watch faces, please add them in the comments section. Or if you have any questions, of course, or feedback, always appreciate that. You can also find me on Twitter at Doug FNJ, and you can find me on a great website called WatchYouSeek.com. A lot of great discussion on different types of brands and different types of watches, great people, great community. So I want to thank you very much for watching this video. I really appreciate all the support. You have yourself a great day. Stay safe, stay healthy, and thanks again.